Welcome to 60 Seconds to Code, where I show you how to code in 60 seconds or less. Today you will learn about debugging and watching code execution using breakpoints. The file you need to follow along in this video is linked in the description. Step 1. Open the file in Visual Studio Code and set the breakpoints at line 789 by clicking on the small margin to the left of the line numbers. Step 2. Click the Run menu in the left navigation and click Run and Debug. And from the drop-down select Python file. Step 3. The debugger will stop the first breakpoint. Breakpoints allow you to pause code execution and inspect what is happening to your code at that particular point. Click the Continue button in the debugging bar to proceed to the next breakpoint. Step 4. At the next breakpoint, click the Step Over button. Step Over allows you to execute the entire line without having to know the details of the execution in that line. Step 5. At the next breakpoint, click the Step Into button. Step into allows you to step into the execution of a function call. Use the step over and step into buttons to watch the execution of your code line by line. Step 6. While you are watching a function execute, you can also watch the variables local to that function in the locals window. As variables come in and out of scope, you will see them in the locals window. Step 7. You can also see what functions are calling what functions in the call stack window. The call stack window tells us that the main module is calling the find max function and we are currently executing the find max function. At any time, you can click the reset button to reset code execution or to stop to stop the code execution. The code is available in a link in the description below. Congratulations, you have learned about debugging and watching code execution in Visual Studio Code. For your homework, try using the debugging console to change the values of a local variable while you are watching code execution and try to code a little every day because code is life.